Live It Out by George Witten. Psalms 112, 6 and 7. Surely he shall not be moved forever. The righteous shall be in everlasting remembrance. He shall not be afraid of evil tidings. His heart is fixed, trusting in the Lord. A few days ago, I wrote about building your house upon the rock because of the violent nature of flash floods and flash rivers that can quickly form in Israel. A few years ago, I was driving through the Dead Sea region to pick up a package when a river from the desert suddenly exploded out of nowhere, sideswiped my car and nearly washed me into the Dead Sea. The force of the river was so powerful that it lifted the rear end of my car off the road, ripping off most of the bumper while the front wheels struggled to maintain traction as I desperately maneuvered out of the cataract and forward to safety. For the next seven hours I was stuck between two rivers as the rain that came down over Israel the night before inundated numerous valleys leading to the Dead Sea. I later spoke with a police officer who informed me that last month a driver in similar circumstances was carried into the Dead Sea and drowned. I believe this is a prophetic picture of what will take place in the near future. When the rivers come out of nowhere, will you be wiped into the sea with no hope? Or will you be one of those who witnesses the raging rivers, but is secure on the rock? I wrote about building your house on the rock, but the key is doing what Yeshua Jesus says. He that hears him and does them. It's all about how you are living it out. Take the Lord's words to heart. Live them out. It could be a matter of life and death. Your family in the Lord with much agape love by George Witten.